respected students welcome back everyone so today's video is about the summarized dax where we are going to check how to calculate the average sum and the multiple measures on the basis of dimension also so properly we are going to check the summarized dax functions uh, which is one of the most important function used in real time project few days back only i have created one video of top 30 dax functions and uh, you have commented many people have commented that uh, come with the practical video if you have not seen that uh, top 30 dax function video you can watch that also okay so before starting uh, let me tell you summarize is nothing but uh, like group by only where uh, you do the grouping of the data on basis of dimension whatever your category name subcategory name dimension is there you do that and then uh, you pass average and sum in it okay so today we will check how to write that uh, dax uh, summarize dax function so always go to this data view table tools and create the new table so i am giving your uh, here name summarize only so summarize average i will give first here okay summarize average then summarize we will pass uh, here table name as intelligence shown here see intelligence this is known as intelligence so after summarize table then group by by column so on which column you want so we want on category name okay so see i am doing this on adventures work uh, data set which is one of the most famous data set whenever the power bi developer uh, starts uh, his power bi journey he starts with this data set only so it is one of the uh, best and little bit complicated so on that database only uh, sorry on that data only we will check so now uh, we have passed summarize okay uh, summarize then category name then we will uh, name this as let's say average price okay then we will pass now this average dax okay this average dax and on which column we want so definitely it will be on numerical column now fact column it will be there so we will pass here product price okay and bracket close so see now you can see here a new table has been created and category name there are four categories bikes component clothing and accessories and their average price has been shown see right now here it is showing eight nine decimals you can uh, change it to two decimals also okay so on the basis of average we have seen so now we will uh, check on the basis of sum also so again go here new table And in new table, uh, we will just copy paste this DAX. Okay. So, and we will change here to sum. And uh, average price, we will change to total price. Because sum is nothing but a total only. So, here we will pass sum DAX. Okay. So, see here we are able to see on the bikes category, the sum is 1,49,514. For accessories, it's just 1,000 rupees. So like this and now the most important third one we will uh, check is that on multiple things if you want to check like total revenue price cost is there on multiple dimension how we will write this DAX this question I am asking in interview okay this is one of the most complicated scenario based question so now we will check for that summarize multiple also so let's again create the new table okay summarize multiple we will give it name then let's go summarize okay then uh, fact table we will take then we want on uh, let's say on region and uh, category name okay comma again we will go down and now we will pass all our majors here first of all we will pass the name okay and here we will pass total revenue okay comma these ever already these measures has been created that only measures we you have to pass here now again total cost okay total cost now we will go again down total order see after completing this measure now you will see the magic how it is showing see? total order comma 
go down and uh, let's say one different one we will pass like percentage one okay and uh, what is the name i guess percentage of all revenue bracket close now see the magic how the new table will be created and see now here region and uh, category name is there the dimension cut which we have passed and here total revenue total cost total order percentage so for bikes the total revenue is this is the total revenue then total order is this total cost in one table only you are able to see these many things so like this one summarized table you might have heard that client says that directly create the summarized table no? so this is the summarized table so like this we can create okay see on this northeast on bikes the total revenue is this 5799 total cost is this total order where this and the percentage is just 0 0.0002 like this see here 1.32 percentage is showing so this is one of the most 100 percent ask and uh, logical scenario based question uh, or DAX which is asked so see now I have maximized here again you can see summarize sales fact then both dimension cut region and uh, category name then total revenue name is given and all the measures are passed by here okay if you like the video make sure you are liking and commenting and uh, please subscribe the channel and press bell icon for all upcoming videos thank you everyone for watching till end